Hi everybody, just bringing you my latest journal. Um, the paper collection that I used in this one was um, from Ultimate Crafts, Magnolia Lane it was called. Um, really, really nice paper. Um, what I've used is a Jats Cracker Box. Um, I sewed the signatures in using the pamphlet stitch and then I put another piece of card over it to hide it so it looks like a normal book. Um, this is one of the cutouts, uh, one of the um, journaling cards in the pack. I've added some lace around that and put some flowers in the corner. Um, really nice paper collection. It's got four signatures with 24 um, pages front and back in each signature. Let's go inside. On the inside I have put a um, pocket on the front and back with a bit of the ephemera out of the pack. Um, I used craft card on it um, just to make it a bit more sturdy. Okay, first signature. Um, this is out the paper collection. Um, the paper is tea and coffee dyed and I have stamped in the corner of the journaling pages. Um, it's got lots of room for journaling and lots of tucks with paper bags and everything in it. There I've done a banner tuck spot for the tag that I've made. A paper bag with just a, another little tag inside. If you have to obey the rules you miss out on all the fun. Um, that's a paper bag that I put lace on. This is a, I'll take that out, um, double doily tuck. You've got one under there and one there. I used um, aged mahogany, Tim Holtz aged mahogany distress ink around the edges of the pages and the edges of the doilies. This is a um, paper bag that I tuck the bottom up. It's just got a plain tag in there and a smaller tag in there. Um, these are rubbers that I had. Um, I've had them for a little while, so a lot of them didn't work. I was sort of really disappointed in the actual rub-ons. We have another packet here with another tag. Um, the only stamping I've done in this book is the actual corners on the pages. Um, I've got a tag down in here and this envelope, um, there's one in each signature. You open it up and it's got a, just a little book in each one. I put butterflies on the strings in those ones. And the top of the picture, um, the envelope tucks down into, but you could also put a tag in there if you wanted to. Push that one back in. Um, on the centre of the um, signatures I've put um, little hearts that I've glued on the end of the strings just to make it all finished off. I have a pocket there with a plain tag. A other side of the paper bag with a plain tag. I glued um, little bits of scraps on the um, bags. I used um, just about everything out of the papers that I used out of the kit. Another bag. More journaling spots. Um, another rub on. Um, there's nothing in that bag, it's just empty. I have a corner tuck spot here. More room for journaling. Um, this is the back of the first signature. I just put a banner on it and tuck that in there. Second signature in this bag. There's another little piece of ephemera out of the kit. And I glued some of the scrap papers on there and there. Another one of the pockets with another tag with rub-ons on it. Another bag with plenty of tags in it. This is a flip tuck spot. Um, this one I 
um, glued some lace. I actually dyed, this was white lace that I got from the markets, and I did the avocado skin dyeing, which it, it looks really good. That's just got a blank tag in it. And the lace goes around the other side. Another one of those, I didn't put a tag in there, but there is a book on the inside of that one. More hearts on the center of the signature. Another one of the bags. And that's got another piece of the ephemera in it. It's a really nice kit, this. A smile is a memory made visible. Another bag. Um, the double doily tuck spot. Another bag with just a plain ticket in it. Another one tuck spot. That's the end of that signature. The paper is absolutely gorgeous. I did it with the mahogany. I thought it went better with it. So I just had to change from the vintage photo. Another bag, the tag in the top, another pocket. Um, these are, I bought these at a local craft store, but I've thrown the packet away so I don't know what brand they are, they're just stickers that stick on. More of the avocado dyed lace, another bag, doing the tuck spot, Center of the signature, another large tag with a clip up. Another bag with just an uh, inch large ticket in it. Another one of these with another book inside it and a tag in the top. Another bag with just a ticket in it. It's been inked around. I tried to put something on these, I went over these with the mahogany because they were very bright, bright pink but I just wanted to cover the, the bag a little bit. That's actually a tuck spot, same on this side, more journaling pages, a tag which I put lace around the edge, the adrenaline that keeps me going, that's me most of the time, another one of the for the tuck spots, the end of the third signature, beautiful paper, absolutely beautiful paper. And because it's 12 by 12, it's really hard of knowing where to cut because you don't want to wreck the picture. Um, another tuck spot, another doily, double doily tuck, same on that side. I've got a belly band there with life a succession of moments to live each one is to succeed. Actually, excuse me, I'm about to start popping up with bronchitis back again. I enjoy another bag with a double tuck. Laughter is the shortest distance between two people. This is another one of the stickers. That's just got another one of the tickets in it. It's been inked around and lays down this side. Another one of the bags with a book on the inside. I'm going to pull it out. A corner tuck, um, bag is the centre of the signature this time, I've got the hearts on the end of the string, um, this is out of the pack, it's a big sheet that you cut it out, um, I put lace down the back of that one, piece of the ephemera, this one I've done a double tuck on this belly band, which has got a, what's got a sticker on it to get out of the kit. There we go. And a large tag at the back, all the tags can be written on the back. I've got something to hold it at the bottom there. Journaling pages, this is a, another banner tuck spot. Another tag in a pocket, and that's the back page. So there you have it. Another journal to put up on my YouTube channel. The um, I'll just show you that quickly. The paper, it's absolutely gorgeous. 
these are the ones that I never actually used. I hope I've got this in camera. In the book, I'll just save them for another one. Absolutely gorgeous. I don't even know if I've got this in camera because I'm using my tablet. So, a few more journals left in this one. Beautiful paper. Yeah. Okay, everybody, there you have it. I don't know whether I'm going to put charms on there or whether I'll just leave it. I don't usually put the flowers on the cover because I like the covers to be flat because you stick them on a shelf and all these eventually get off. These are tiny little rosebuds that I got from a local craft store and I haven't been able to get them since, which is a bit of a disappointment. So there you have it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you at my next video. Bye.